Well, double trouble for the <laughs> dynamic duo. Welcome everyone to our Tuesday evening introduction to LifeWave and the star of the show X39, where we get together every Tuesday evening with your co-hosts Robin and Gregory to um, give you a little overview of a very special company and a breakthrough technology. And what we do on this call is Gregory does a short presentation, and then we bring on our special guest practitioner. This night, we're blessed to have Dr. Barbara Jennings, and then we open things up for you. So if you have stories or questions, please put them in the Q&A section, and we'll take them. And if you want to make sure that they get asked, symptoms only, <laughs> and put it in early. Those are your tips. So I'm going to turn things over to Gregory right now, Great. and we will move forward through the presentation. Over Great. to you, honey. Well, I'm going to go ahead and share my screen, so please hold on a moment here. And let me uh, get things going here with the presentation. There we go. Uh, oh, maybe we didn't. Hold on just one second. We're having a little bit more technical difficulties. Um, I'm not sure if everybody's seeing the screen, so hold on. I apologize. Um, the system crashed just as we're getting ready to start tonight. So, uh, yeah. Okay, so I should be able to share the, share the screen now. Okay, here we go. Let the show begin. <laughs> okay, well, welcome to our webinar about activating your stem cells. And I'll just share with you a realization I came to a number of years ago. I finally figured out what I want to be when I get older, younger. And I bet you many of you can relate to that. And so, if anything were possible, let me ask you one question. If you could change one thing in your experience, in your health, or in the health of someone you love and care for, what would that be? And what difference would that make for you or them? Think about that. You might have a loved one or maybe yourself that's dealing with some type of discomfort, a, a nagging symptom of aging, as we like to say. And you know, what difference would it make if we could show you a way to minimize or maybe even eliminate that symptom. Well, just let me make a quick note that our products are not designed or intended to heal, treat, diagnose, or cure any disease. They do help put our body back in a much more healthy state, and many things can then begin to happen. So welcome to the stem cell revolution, because we believe everyone wants to look, feel, perform, and live younger, and stem cells are the key because they're a vital part of our immune system, it helps repair and regenerate damaged cells. Now, the problem is the older we get, the less cells we have. And by age 60, only a small percentage remains. And sadly, the fewer stem cells we have, the faster we age and the slower we heal. That's why a young lad falls down and skins his knee and three days later, scab falls off. Grandma falls down, skins her knee and breaks her hip and she may never get out of the hospital. Well, the problem is stem cells decline as we age, as I said earlier. And by the age 60, you've got very few left. So what about stem cell injections? Because they become quite popular, but you know what? They're quite expensive. They can be painful, risky, controversial. And you know what? There's no guaranteed results. You could spend thousands or tens of thousands of dollars, and you may or may not get the results you're after. Well, we've got some good news to share with you tonight because you can look, feel, perform, and live younger with a historic breakthrough in affordable stem cell technology. It's a new wearable technology in patch form. As I said, it's affordable, it's safe, it's non-invasive, it's drug-free, and a patented form of phototherapy that uses specific frequencies of light to increase and improve our stem cell activity. A revolutionary idea from our, David, our visionary founder and CEO, David Schmidt. Now, David is not only a brilliant scientist, and researcher. He is also a genius inventor with over 130 patents and patent pendings. Uh, and he's been on the leading edge of phototherapy research and science for over 20 years. Now, David's already conducted over 80 clinical studies proving the efficacy of LifeWave phototherapy, and many more are always in the works. And that's because LifeWave is a very science focused, high technology company focused in the field of health sciences. It was founded back in 2004 based on an energy enhancing technology that David developed under contract with the US government for Navy SEALs to increase their strength and their stamina 
their performance without using drugs, stimulants, or caffeine. It turned out to be so effective. It's now used by professional athletes worldwide. Uh, we have corporate headquarters, laboratory and manufacturing now in California, Utah, and Ireland. And we're already doing global distribution over 75 countries from our 15 global distribution centers. So the words getting out and pro and amateur athletes around the world in almost every sport are using our products for enhanced performance and rapid recovery. And here are some names you probably know. Serena Williams, David Beckham, soccer star, and Michael Phelps and his entire team of, you know, Olympic swimmers. So, you know, how does this amazing technology work? And real quickly, let me just give you a brief understanding. It's based on a type of photo of light therapy called photobiomodulation. And LifeWay patches contain very specific combinations of organic materials and nanocrystals. And when they're applied or near the body, they're activated by our body heat and they begin to emit very specific wavelengths of light, which stimulates targeted and beneficial biochemical responses in the body. So photobiomodulation is a basis for our LifeWay phototherapy patches and technology. Now, it's been a well-recognized and proven scientific principle that specific frequencies of light can cause specific changes within our body. For example, we all know when we go outside in the sun, a specific frequency of light causes our body to make vitamin D. We don't get a vitamin D download from the sun. We get a light frequency download from the sun, and our body goes, oh, manufacture vitamin C. Likewise, another frequency of sun sunlight causes our body to make melanin the chemical that gives us a suntan. Well, LifeWave's patented technology is based on the same rock solid, widely recognized scientific principle. Our focus for the last 14 years has been in the field of anti-aging and regenerative science. And four years ago, we released to the global market, the LifeWave Stem Cell Activation Patch X39. It's a historic and affordable breakthrough in stem cell activation that some are calling the holy grail of anti-aging and restorative science because we're actually doing what the multi-billion dollar companies in big pharma have not been able to do. And that is X39 actually activates a very specific copper peptide that activates our body's own stem cells while also altering gene expression of over 4,000 genes towards a younger and more vibrant you. So yes, you can grow younger. So it's a game changer. It's a true breakthrough. And David uh, Schmidt, our founder, says this is my a greatest accomplishment yet, with an emphasis on yet, because David spends more time in the laboratory uh, than he does in, an, in any office. So yes, we have patents. Yes, we have clinical studies. Yes, we have field results proving that X39 is actually turning back our biological clock helping people to look, feel, perform, and live younger. And for us baby boomers, this is very exciting news. So I'm going to step out of the picture here and turn the next part of this call over to my partner in life and my beloved wife, Robin. <laughs> here you go. It's a musical cheers here. <laughs> One must be flexible. Does the patch help with that? <laughs> okay hi everybody well it is my pleasure that was a great job honey thank you uh, especially with the crash happening that's a pro you know that can just move with <laughs> the challenges we have so go, this you go with the flow you go with the flow so this evening we are blessed and privileged to have one of our favorites they're all our favorites actually we love them all we have many many healthcare practitioners in LifeWave, and we have them for a reason, is um, they're drawn to us because of the hard science behind it, but then they get to see how it enhances the clinical outcome. So Dr. Barbara is our guest this evening, and she comes to us with a very unique background. It started out as a classical pianist, uh, but sadly had a very severe thyroid autoimmune life-threatening disease, and Worked with a natural practitioner that really, really transformed her life. 
went into chiropractic college, is now a chiropractor and has many, many tools in her tool chest. She's She loves working with people that have challenges with hormones and autoimmune situations. And she is a detox specialist. She's a gift, a huge gift to our community. We always get to learn a lot from her. Welcome, Dr. Barbara. Thank you. I think the last time I saw you, we were dipping our toes, getting uh, in the in water. The ocean. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, lovely. I was going to say having the fish take off the dead skin. <laughs> oh, yes, that too. <laughs> <laughs> so welcome, my dear. Um, let's jump in mm -hmm. and ask, what is it that drew you to be open and receptive to wanting to work with LifeWave or, you know, even try it? Uh, well, part of that was that I trusted my friend, Michelle, who told me about these these patches. And second, was that I had heard of the GHK copper peptide. Couldn't remember exactly what it was, what it did, but I remember at least studying for it for uh, about it for board exams. Um, and but mostly it was the prospect of possibly finding an affordable way to help my patients increase stem cells, because <clears throat> the only other way cost many thousands of dollars. <laughs> So I was I was interested in trying it and finding out more. Wonderful. So this is really important for everyone to realize because so many of us want all of our practitioners to be using it. And the best way to get to your practitioner is a relationship with a practitioner versus going cold because they get introduced to things all the time. So let's talk about X39, the star of the show. Who is it for? Who isn't it for? <clears throat> for everybody who has a body <laughs> it's uh it's not recommended for two groups of people that i'm aware of <clears throat> one is if you've had an organ transplant and and on an immunosuppressive drug um and the second is those undergoing active chemotherapy treatments. You can use it before and after, but it's not recommended during because it does have antioxidant properties, which will make that chemo less effective. Okay. So it's safe, even if people are on meds? It has no interactions with, with medications. Uh, it's safe for pretty much all ages. Uh, they do say maybe you know, wait until a, a baby is old enough to communicate verbally uh, before you put one on uh, a, an infant. Uh, but yes, they're for everybody. They're safe for everybody. You cannot hurt yourself with these patches. Ah, isn't that wonderful that it's so safe? Mm -hmm. Love it. Now, Indeed. you know, we live in this fast paced world and people want instant gratification. If someone says, well, how long will it take for me to notice something? Uh, that's what everybody wants to know. And that's what I think ev everyone wishes they could predict, but we can't. Uh, we, we cannot know. I have seen um, not very many people, but a couple of people notice a difference on day one. You know, usually it's somebody who has pain that notices uh, a decrease in in um, uh, in pain that quickly. <clears throat> and I've had people take as long as four or five months before they really have a noticeable uh, change. They notice some kind of benefit uh, and everything in between. I think the most common is within the first couple of weeks. Uh, it took me a little less than a week uh, to notice that I had more energy and I was sleeping better. Beautiful. So I was trying it myself first and I thought, <laughs> who, who doesn't want more energy and better sleep? So that's when I decided to try it on a, a few patients. Beautiful, beautiful. So the message is give it some time. Whatever's going on in your body didn't happen overnight and we need to be patient. So in order to get the maximum benefit of utilizing this technology, what do you recommend to people, Dr. Barbara? <clears throat> Well, uh, so David Schmidt, the inventor, does recommend and, and advise that you be well hydrated. <clears throat> Everything in your body works better with uh, being properly hydrated. So 
have enough minerals in your body so you can absorb water into your cells, drink enough water, you know, roughly half your body weight in ounces every day. And the second one is you need enough copper in your diet, <clears throat> whether you eat it in, in foods or take it as a supplement. Uh, you need enough copper to make that copper peptide because that really is what the patch does. It stimulates our bodies to make more GHK copper peptide. And only after that is elevated, that's when it will trigger our body's stem cell production. Beautiful, beautiful. So we've got to do our part. Right. And how often do you wear these patches? Well, I wear them every day. <clears throat> uh, you can wear them every day or or less often, but they're <clears throat> they are designed to be used consistently, right? The ideally you would wear them consistently, meaning for 12 hours every day or night. And then you you take a break for 12 hours before you put that patch on again so that your body doesn't get used to that light frequency and start kind of ignoring it. So in order to maintain their effectiveness, uh, 12 hours on, 12 hours off. Okay, so what I heard was hydration, uh, supplementing with making sure you're well mineralized mm -hmm. and copperized, right. either supplemental copper or food with that contains copper, consistency, 12 hours on, 12 hours off. Yes. <clears throat> All right. That's Great. right. Thank now, you, thank you, thank as you. with everything health-related, they'll work better if your body has less inflammation and and is a, a cleaner, healthier body. So, you know, if you want maximum results, you really should be eating a clean diet. You should be avoiding sugar and <clears throat> processed foods and yucky oils, you know, trans fats. Uh, those, you know, those are the obvious things. And we could go into more detail, but don't need to right now. Okay. So that that's it's they they are miraculous, but we have to do our work too. And if you want to get maximum benefit, eating a clean diet, you know, and and it everyone has different preferences, but staying away, like you said, of processed foods and sugar can make a big difference for people. Huge. Wonderful, yes. huge, not big, but huge, huge I hope, difference. I hope yeah. everyone heard that. Yes, N that's name great. a health problem and avoiding sugar will make it. Them will will be a part of your getting better. I hope everybody heard that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's great. Okay, so um, I know it happened to me. What do you say to people when they start using X thirty nine and something hurts more? Oh well, I say <clears throat> good. <laughs> that, that means it's that's working. exactly what Doctor Nicholas said to me. <laughs> oh, good, it's working. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> So, of course, it doesn't feel good to have uh, more pain or an exacerbated symptom, whatever unpleasant thing it might be. But the fact that it's changing with, uh, with these patches is a good sign because as your body uh, sloughs off the old damaged cells, uh, they just get let go out into, say, uh, the space in your knee joint and having more stem cells enables your body to create new healthier cells and replace them but they don't just evaporate into nothing they have to be removed right so that those old cells are sloughed off and can very temporarily um, create a little bit more discomfort or pain or, you know, something that feels like it's getting worse in that area. <clears throat> uh, so if that happens to somebody, I strongly encourage you to don't stop wearing them. You might want to decrease the hours you wear them. You can always do fewer than 12 hours. You might want to do six hours or four hours a day and work your way up. But the fact that something feels worse in the short term uh, means that things are rocking and rolling and they're actually good things. 
I love it because like I said, it happened to me with an old injury. And so I typically tell people about that, especially if they've been very athletic or their body's been through a lot that this may happen and Mm -hmm. it's a good thing. And, um, and it's, you said a very magic word, temporary. Yes. That's really important. And what Dr. Barbara said is if it's too much, take it off, but it's temporary. And if you can leave it, leave it on as long as you can, and it'll make it get better faster. But if it's too much, take it off. It's not like a pill. You can't untake it. You just pull off the patch. How fun. All right. Okay. So what else do you want to tell our wonderful audience before we jump into their stories and questions? Um, so I was talking to my friend Jaren yesterday and she said something really interesting. Uh, she was talking to, I think, a, a veterinarian or maybe someone else. And, but she, she has a, a sore knee and the doctor told her that her knee ought to be causing a lot of pain, but she doesn't have a lot of pain. And she's been using these patches, uh, one month less than I have. <laughs> So about three and a half years. And uh, she said something I think is really helpful to to remember also. And that is sometimes feeling nothing means it's working. So she she has no pain in in a place she ought to have pain. and, And she didn't even realize it. Isn't it? That's why we recommend, you want to talk about the health tracker and the importance of getting a good baseline? Oh, yes. Uh, very important uh, to, to use the health tracker. It's just a, a one pager with the most common symptoms <laughs> that people experience, or at least uh, symptoms where people notice changes uh, the most with uh, using X39 patch. And you really want to start, you know, fill it out preferably before you even put a patch on, but, you know, as close to day one or day zero as you can. And then it'll, you know, it has another date, come back in a week, come back in a month, come back in three months. It's very important to do that because people don't notice normal. You notice pain, you you know, that's noticeable, but as the pain goes away, unless it's fast, it's not very noticeable. And um, nobody notices feeling normal. So we, we expect things to move towards normal. They may go quickly, they may go very slowly, but it is going to go in that direction. So keep track and number or score those symptoms for yourself so that you have your own objective um, scores to compare to. Beautiful. Really, really important. Some people even like to do a baseline uh, blood panel and and come back in six months because for some pretty fascinating things. So mm-hmm. body's amazing. It's a miracle. And its job, from what I heard, is to come back to homeostasis. And this technology helps it do what it's designed to do. Right. Okay. Anything else before we jump into the questions? Uh. Well, I could talk for hours, but I know. Um, <laughs> well, is there anything I'm missing that we should share tonight or should we jump in? Um, I just wanted to share what Jaron said because I thought that was a really sure. wise thought. And uh, so I shared that sometimes right. feeling nothing means it's working. So I believe that they're working whether or not you feel it. <clears throat> so maybe you have pain that's not going to go away in the first month or even in the first two months. To me, that tells me that your body has something more important, more urgent that it needs to fix before it gets to your knee pain or the hip pain or whatever it is. Whatever it is. Stem cells are really smart. They're very smart. Your body's way smarter than our our conscious mind is. And I trust the body. Uh, I really trust it. And if it takes a long time to get to what hurts, then that's good because it means more important things are being addressed. Beautiful, beautiful. And it and it is cumulative. It gets better over time. So it's really fun. Okay, yes. let's jump in here. Um, Heidi, as a chiropractor, is there a best practice for wearing patches stacked on top of each other? 
at specific acupuncture spots rather than simply on C7 upon uh, the neck and X39 on top and uh, X49 below the belly button. So is the question that was Is long. there a better, is, <laughs> would, do you recommend people's, you know, stack so, pack, like would X39 and X39 work, 49 work if they were one on top of the other? Oh. Should they be separated? Are there better, you know, mm -hmm. locations, different yeah. ones? Interestingly, you can stack them. You can stack them right on top of each other. And I would think that wearing two of them over your C7 uh, would be just fine. Okay. They, they still work. Okay, so here's someone that has a thyroid challenge. Um, what's your recommendation for a slow thyroid with a typical autoimmune issue and which patches where uh, someone's had it for many, many years? It's an anonymous person. All right. This condition for 30 years. Okay, well, there's a lot to do for that. <clears throat> but since we're talking about patches here, um, I would definitely use Eon the Eon patch, because that helps modulate your immune system. <clears throat> um, I always use uh, Eon with autoimmune conditions of any kind. I, I would use <clears throat> the glutathione patch on your thyroid because an important part is detoxing the, the, uh, the thyroid. The thyroid is a sponge for <clears throat> many different types of toxins. And we really want to help get those out so the right things can attach to the receptors there. Um, you've got to change your diet. You, you absolutely have to avoid gluten and soy and probably dairy. That's an absolute must or you will not get better no matter what you do. Um, and then definitely X39. It doesn't matter where you use that one, but I like glutathione over the thyroid and Eon doesn't matter as well. Beautiful, because they are systemic. And um, yep. isn't that wonderful? And you know, you, you, you've you talked about food a few times. Food can be poison or medicine. And so we have control of that. And if we want to get better, we need yep. to make better choices. Okay. And just a, just a heads up, when if you're going to use glutathione on the thyroid, that that's a very powerful patch. It's very potent. It works quickly. Um, you may not want to spend all 12 hours with it over the thyroid, but as the thyroid detoxes and lets go of toxins, you may get a rash uh, right there over your thyroid. Um, and that's a detox rash. Uh, it can be itchy. It can you know look red and itchy. Um, and be a little uncomfortable, but again, it means that junk is coming out of your thyroid. That's a good thing. It's a good thing. Sometimes it doesn't feel good, but it is temporary. Yeah. Okay. All right, Janet. Um, friend, a friend is having swelling in her legs, and she's trying to pass kidney stones. Which patch or patches are the most effective? I had her place Eon on both legs, but want to know if that was the best choice. Thank you. All right, swelling in your legs. Um, so I would put the energy enhancer patches on kidney one points on the bottom of your feet. Uh, I would do that. Um, I would use glutathione um, on that, you know, three finger width above your ankle on the inside of your ankle, the, the same point we use for SP6. Uh, you can put one on each side. You can also put the glutathione um, just behind the ankle bone. Um, so that's going to help decrease inflammation. But glutathione also helps circulation and microcirculation. So uh, that's an important thing that that people don't realize, right? And I, that's a new one on me. So thank yeah. you. Yeah, so that's support cool. circulation. Um, X39 for sure. And swelling, uh, I would also take a really good mineral supplement. Uh, sometimes increasing your minerals helps your body absorb the water inside your cells so that the water you drink doesn't stay out of the cells and succumb to gravity and end up in your feet. 
Beautiful. That was a lot of great information. And maybe if you could put how people can contact you, Dr. Barbara, because Dr. Barbara, sure. and um, most of our practitioners do consults. And so you can reach out to them with more personal and um, detailed information about what you're wanting to get better with the patches. Okay. Charmaine um, says, what would you recommend for a teenager with severe toenail fungus? <laughs> excuse me, she eats a clean, uh, gluten-free, dairy-free diet, has numerous supplements, topical essential oils, to no avail. And sadly, she's lost most of her nails on her toes. Oh, you'll want to just hit your head when I tell you this, because usually, <laughs> usually this is a pretty easy fix. You just need to be consistent. So if you take uh, a plastic tub, put enough warm water in it to, to come to the bottom of your ankle, cover your feet, and then put in one cup of raw apple cider vinegar and soak your feet for half an hour every night in, in that and do it every night for at least two weeks. Um, if you have essential oils, I would add um, a couple drops of oregano oil to that. And I've never had that not work. That will take care of warts on your feet. It'll take care of toe fungus, athlete's foot. It's just vinegar. Oh my <laughs> it's goodness, awesome. apple cider vinegar is the miracle. I love it. Keep, I keep love it, it in your medicine cabinet for that sure. Is, yeah. We always get to learn such great things from you. Thank and you. use glutathione, the glutathione patch. Where would you put it? Does it matter? It doesn't matter for that. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. You Great. could uh, you could topically apply oregano oil to the nails themselves, but they just need some time to soak in vinegar water and uh, and some oregano. Ooh, I'm gonna share that one for mm -hmm. sure. Wow, thank you, thank you. Okay, Darlene, what patches would you suggest to remove excess lactic acid from your muscles? Um, well, you need some calcium lactate, uh, to help with that. <laughs> um, so patches, um, you I would, I would, other it, thing. you can share apple cider vinegar too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Soak your muscle in apple cider vinegar. Um, no, yeah. so patches, I would use glutathione and so think circulation. Also, you want to use the muscle. You want to move the blood flow through that muscle. So glutathione, X39, energy enhancer, um, lactic acid. Uh, that, that's a really big topic, actually. Um, but for our purposes, that, that's probably enough. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. John says, Dr. Jennings, can you describe clinically your husband's experience with his rotator cuff issue and what the X39 patch did for him? Uh, That's a great yes. yes. So my, my husband had a bad shoulder and uh, had surgery, lots of arthritis in the shoulder. Um, he, he caught something heavy and felt a big pop and a snap. And after that, he couldn't curl any weight whatsoever. He couldn't lift higher than 90 degrees. And for a guy who does 80, 90 push-ups every other day since he was 19 years old, he could not even hold a plank position for one second. Uh, so he had this uh, significant injury to his shoulder. <clears throat> the orthopedic surgeon said, all we can do is a shoulder replacement because there's so much arthritis in there so let us know when you're ready for that. <laughs> uh, so I told him, you know, I don't know what the patches can do, but let's find out, you know, they'll only help. So I had him put on the glutathione patch because of all of the inflammation and all the arthritis in there. We want to reduce inflammation anywhere you want the stem cells to work. You want to reduce inflammation in that area. So glutathione, and it hurt the most right there. So he put right on the on the corner, he put the X39 there. And I actually told him to put glutathione and Eon on either sides, but he only did the glutathione and he only did it for one month. <laughs> but 
um, two years later, he still uses the glutathione there. So um, in three months time, he could do more than 50 push-ups. And he was he could he could curl. He he was he was a little nervous to try full weight, but he could do 10 pounds, 20 pounds. Um, and after about four months, he said, look, I, I'm hitting the golf ball further than I ever have in my life. <laughs> so so not only did it feel better, his his range of motion came back, his strength came back but he kept using them. And I always want to tell people this part. So that injury happened in January. He kept using X39 consistently. And in November, um, he woke up in the morning laying on his left side. And you have to understand, he hasn't been able to sleep on his left side for 20 years because it hurt. He could not lay on his left side. And he woke up on his left side and I'm like, why are you sleeping like that? You never sleep like that. It's like it doesn't hurt. So now he can sleep on both sides equally. Uh, but that last part, you know, that was uh, 11 months down the road. So all of that time there was repairing re and, and healing going on. Beautiful. And now he does 10 minute planks, right? <laughs> well, now he's doing, I don't know how many push-ups, but he, he still does his push-ups every other day. There you go. He's there in good shape. Mm -hmm. Great exercise. Wonderful. That's an amazing story. And, and it does continue to get better and we want to keep supporting it, like Dr. Barbara said. Okay, Christina has a fun story. She said her daughter was using the tummy protocol when she was exercising and eats well and use the patches and her cellulite went away. That's fun to hear. Um, good. Her question is one of her brand partners just signed up uh, his mother who's having some back issues. Uh, she has some tissue between the vertebrae that are swollen and in a lot of pain. They have glutathione, Eon, IceWave X49 and 39. What do you suggest, Dr. Barbara? Those are very good choices. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Yeah, uh, that is what I would suggest, except for maybe energy enhancer, um, uh, just to support overall energy and, and the flow in the body. Uh, I would probably start on the bottom of the feet and also shoulders. Um, yeah, uh, I think that's good. Uh, that, that is exactly what I would recommend. You've got what good you thinking. need. And she's going to get better. Wait, make sure she does the baseline because she's going to have some wonderful experience. Yes. yes. Tracking um, sheet right there. The tracking sheet. Mm -hmm. So Luis, um, uh, so he has a guest here that uh, started using X39 a week ago and his blood pressure has been going up and down since he started. Um, are there any contraindications and any ideas why the blood pressure is changing? Thank you for asking that, Luis, because I've heard that happen with other people. And I'm going to let Dr. Barber address it for you. Well, that it, it can go up and down. Usually it, it goes more, more down than up. <clears throat> uh, but your body is making a lot of adjustments. Things different body parts don't all heal at the same time in the same place in the same rate. Um, so let's say I, I'm reviewing a week ago, blood pressure down. Yeah, I, I would just say be consistent, <clears throat> continue to use it every day, be consistent. Over time, the blood pressure we've seen typically goes down and stabilizes. Beautiful, beautiful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, yeah, I've heard lots of people have that experience that the blood pressure is not stabilized and it does do a variety of things, but in time is, mm -hmm. is the key. So stay yeah. with it. Stay with I, I would it add in. the Eon patch, mm -hmm. uh, in right. that situation. Okay. Wonderful. Thank you. Um, David is asking, uh, can you anticipate improvements in eyesight or other more challenging health issues with your eyes? using X39? Uh, I can't anticipate them, but I can tell you some people experience improvements in their eyesight and other eye-related conditions. Not everybody, but some people do. 
if you really want to target that, then you could use uh, sleep with an eye mask. And on the inside, where it would be facing your eyes, you can apply uh, the carnosine patch, uh, the glutathione patches, uh, and the X39 patches. Beautiful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, Tammy wants to know, when you got started with LifeWay, what protocol did you use? Was your autoimmune healthy? Um, were you treating it? Myself? Yeah. Oh, uh, no, my autoimmune condition uh, was still, um, what's it called? It reversed, not active. Beautiful. Yeah. Uh, okay. I manage that mainly with diet. Uh, but I also take a fair amount of supplements myself to, to keep myself healthy there. Beautiful. Thank you. Okay. Emma, is, what patch do you use for uh, degenerative discs in the neck? Uh, gl uh, glutathione, Eon, and definitely X39. So I hope everyone's hearing a pattern here. Mm -hmm. It almost doesn't matter what the situation is. X39, Ian, and glutathione are consistent. Yes. For this one, actually, I would really add X49 as well, because right. X49, which activates the AHK copper peptide, it actually will increase our collagen production maybe three times as much as if you only used X39 alone. Mm -hmm. So discs, discs uh, are they have a very fibrous collagen, um, mainly collagen um, uh, outside. And so if you want to heal those things, you want more collagen. So eat good quality protein. Be sure you not have enough acid in your stomach to digest that protein. So you can assimilate it and your body will rearrange it into collagen proteins. Beautiful. Beautiful. And the final question for this evening, um, what if you don't have a thyroid at all? It was surgically removed. Um, is there anything that you would recommend? Uh, yes. So you've got to take your thyroid medication. I mean, that's a must. Um, my question would be why, why was it removed? And then I would want to look at the conditions in the body that got you to that point and start working on those. Was it an autoimmune condition? Was it thyroid cancer? Was it a uh, hyperthyroid? You know, what was it? Um, and you probably need to detox still. Uh, thyroids, like I said, they're sponges for toxins. And yeah. <clears throat> so in general, you would want to uh, I would use the energy enhancer patches on a regular basis to support your body's energy, uh, energy production, help help your your thyroid hormones um, do their job uh, in your muscles. And every cell has a thyroid hormone receptor. Uh, I would use glutathione and Eon and, uh, and of course, X39 always. Always, of course, X39 Always. is foundational for everything. Well, thank you, thank you, thank you, Dr. Barber. That was fascinating, educational, uh, inspiring. <laughs> we so appreciate you um, donating. You know, our practitioners give of themselves and their, their wisdom to our community every week. And we are so grateful for all that you do for all of us. And, and thank you all that showed up tonight. And if you're a guest, I hope you're taking notes. And my invitation to you is to get started. There is no risk. Uh, the patches do come with a guarantee. So get back to the person that invited you. We have a wonderful customer program if it's just for yourself. But if you're the kind of person that's going to be sharing, we recommend you become a brand partner and get started and start sharing. The world needs our voices because a lot of people don't know this exists and it can make a huge difference, give people hope for the future and literally transform people's well-being and enjoy life more. So thanks for taking the time, everyone, to be with us tonight. Of course, thank you, Gregory. Love his presentation every week.
and we will yeah. say goodbye. I did put my my uh, contact Good. info in the chat, but if you didn't see it, it's info at drbarbarajennings.com. Great. Info at drbarbarajennings.com and you're in for a treat. And Dr. Barbara mentioned detoxing. You know, if there is a condition in your body, it's really a good first step. And Dr. Barbara is an expert. And I took a four month course from her and it was literally um, an education of a lifetime that I will never forget. And it comes with a great, it was amazing. So um, if you have anything seriously wrong, that's a really good first place to start. Get the things out of your body that don't belong there so your body can be the miracle that it is. And then yep. patches, of course. Okay, thanks yep. everybody. Bye-bye. Good, good night.